The view from 120 metres over the Atlantic as vital supplies are transported to Inishmore. Preparations for this test flight have been going on for months. A range of agencies and different specialities all combining in the hope they'd achieve a safe landing. What was going through my head was it was a year's worth of planning. We had all the right people there, so we knew that we had ticked all the boxes and we had all the skills. But you're wondering what's going to happen as it's coming across. And, and the Wingcopter drone is actually white with large wings. So we had nicknamed it the Seagull as it was coastal flying. And when it came in and it landed and we all shouted, the Seagull has landed. And it was a fantastic moment to show that we actually had done what we set out to do. Described as the world's first beyond visual line of sight drone delivery of insulin, the flight took place after the Irish Aviation Authority gave special permission to researchers. The journey from Airport Namina in Connemara to the airstrip on Inishmore took around a quarter of an hour to complete. Well, I think it's fantastic. I think certainly it has uh, amazing possibilities and particularly since our air service is constantly under threat, this is maybe where we have to go. Insulin was dispatched in specially designed packaging which was placed in a small parcel box on the drone. And for the return leg to the mainland, a patient's blood sample was transported. OK, we're all ready to send back. So For those in need of life-saving medication, the latest technology brings reassurance. Unfortunately, there are days due to fog when the plane cannot come in. In those cases, the drone is able to just step in and bring in the essential medicines that we need. It's hoped the delivery can be used as a starting point for formulating more extensive drone dispatches to remote locations. Pat McGrath, RTE News, Galway.